Shout out to 1010 Sports. Make sure y'all tune in. My name is Ryan Pritchard. I go to University Academy, class of 2019. I had an uncle that plays football. Uh -huh. uh, so I've been mean, pretty much him and me, that's pretty much it. So. so did he get you started in playing football? He actually, he kind of did in a way. He told mm -hmm. me about it. He used to be outside, playing catch, stuff like that. And so, yeah, I can say he, yeah, he got me into it. Okay, okay. Now, did he, I mean, at your height, what are you, 6'4"? Like, yeah, 6'3". 6'3"? Yeah. So, at your height, usually guys play basketball. Yeah. So, what made you switch to football? I don't know. I just, from first sight, I just fell in love with it. Yeah. It was always, I always felt a connection with it more than basketball, I guess. So, I just decided to roll with it. Okay. Go from the jump. That's what I was taught. I just, especially when it's like a shorter guy on me, I just... Go. I mean, nobody's nobody's safe. That's how I look at it. So, <laughs> so what type of receiver are you? Like, um, you know, some receivers are bullies. Mm -hmm. You know, they like to see a guy up on them and throw them around. Mm -hmm. Some receivers just only like, I'm going deep. Mm -hmm. Some receivers like like the contact going across the middles, but others shy away from it. Mm -hmm. So, which type of receiver are you? Uh, I'm gonna definitely sometimes try to be versatile, but I'll say overall, I'm more of a kind of like a I'm kind of going deep, like, don't touch me, like, get off of me, I'm trying to go type of receiver, you know, my op my objective is just to catch the ball just any way I can, so I'll say I'm more, more of like a get off of me type of receiver. Yeah, I've seen a couple times during the season, man, you was just kind of like Randy Moss and cats, like, <laughs> you jump, like, they couldn't jump with you, so you, yeah. they throw it up, you they try to jump with you, and then when you come down, you still was strong enough to get the per player off of you mm -hmm. and then keep running. Yeah. Like, so talk about a little bit about your, your like your breakaway speed. Yeah. Uh, doing them situations. Like, what do you think? Like, we in the air. Like, I'm, <laughs> there's no way he's taking me down. Or what, what is yeah. it? Like when I'm in the air, yeah, that's that's exactly what I'll be thinking. I'll be like, like you can't bring me down right now. I gotta go. Like, <laughs> so it's like I'm just on a, I'm on a mission, and while I'm on that mission, can't nobody stop me at the moment. So now you were a part of uh, one of university's cat academies first classes to play in y'all new football field. Yes, sir. How was that? Because I know, yeah. tell me what it was like yeah. before. First of all, yeah. tell me like it, what oh, it was like before, before. <laughs> and then to that new beautiful stadium that I got. Yeah, before it was, it was hard. It was a tough role. I mean, practices, field, you know, uneven, things like that. It was, it was challenging, you know, focusing on trying not to get hurt sometimes, stuff like that. And then to see it transform within a couple of months to the beautiful facility that we have now, so, I mean, it was, it's wonderful. I mean, first game, feet wasn't hurting, you know, worrying about with bumps and things <laughs> like that. It was, it was wonderful. It was pretty fun too. I enjoyed it. Were y'all motivated by like the fans? Like that's your first yes, time having, I mean, your yeah. fans have come, but that was your home. Yeah. So we felt, we finally felt like at home with the crowd behind us. It was, it was wonderful. And that, that's what I'm excited for next season also. I'll say my freshman year, I had a couple guys. I had an um, actual receiver before me, his name was Alex. Mm -hmm. He uh, he taught me the way, he told me, basically, in the game, I mean, you can be friends with people, but during the game, you had to make sure that you're doing what you're doing so you can become successful. You know, he just, he brought me up, he taught me what, what not to do on the field, mm -hmm. what, what not to do before game, after game, you know, to keep my character up and yeah. become a man, basically, so. So, who, where is he at now? Where's he at? I believe he's at K State. I want to say. He yeah. playing for K State? Uh, I don't know. Just a, I, I, don't know. I think he's just a student, student there right school. now. But yeah, he most definitely, I would say, was like my mentor. Shout, shout him out, Alex. Uh, shout out Alex Summers, the third. So. Like, uh, um, a lot of Drake. I've been listening to a lot of Drake. You've been Kiki. Uh, You've been doing the Kiki dance. <laughs> something like that. Something like that. But uh, yeah, I listen to a lot of Drake. So I mean. Anything him, they really gets me through football training and stuff like that. Favorite food to eat? Buffalo wings. I love some wings, especially buffalo. I can eat honey barbecue every once in a while, but you get you a good buffalo wing, you set. So from where? I would say this place called Wings Cafe. Uh, it's by uh, Westport. I would say yeah, Wings Cafe. Good ten piece with some fries. So yeah. I didn't know about that one, man. I gotta pull up on that one. Yes, sir. That's new? Uh, kinda is for a couple of years. I think it's kinda new, yeah, in a way. 
Cause I never heard of them when I was little, so. Uh, man, I still be, well, I used to go to Wings and things all the time, and then, but they take forever. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Forever, dude. What is your favorite movie and why? Hmm. Favorite movie, I would say, is Drumline. <laughs> Drumline? Yeah, Drumline. I like Drumline a lot. Um, I've always watched it when I was little. I'll still be watching it. I know like all the lines. I just like it because it's just, I feel like it's like a real movie. Like, <laughs> it's just, it's cool. Like, I just like the movie. I like how he came to a college and, you know, made a difference mm -hmm. and changed it up. So. Does he, do you, so do you play an instrument? No, I don't play did, no instrument. Did it inspire nah. you to play no instrument? <laughs> no, nah, I never wanted to play an instrument. I don't know. I just always told myself, if I do band, I'm going to make sure I do the drums just like Nick Cannon, but I never. <laughs> so you motivated by Nick Cannon? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's all right, man. Did it motivate you to go to HBCU? Uh, I've been actually thinking about HBCUs lately, so mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, that's that's another reason why I like the movie too. You know, the um, it shows you, you know, our, the culture and stuff like that within the colleges and things like that. Yeah. So yeah. Hey man, ain't nothing like an HBCU. I love it, man. Mm -hmm. And the bands, just like Drumline, it's like that, man. It's real. It's real. Actually, sometimes the bands practice more than the football team. Huh. It's crazy. <laughs> <out there. laughs> but hey, you can't beat the HBCU, man. It goes. Uh, biggest inspiration I say is my mother. She uh, seeing like how she grew up and what she's been doing, things like that, definitely drives me every day yeah. to um, want to be able to give her what she wants. You know, when I get older. So. Yeah. Oh, your mama goes off at the games. <laughs> Can you hear her in the yeah. stand? Oh, she be yeah. going in, man. I'll she's a good it. supporter, man. <laughs> yeah. Are you the only kid? No, I have an older sister. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so she in college also? Uh, no, she graduated college from uh, UCM. All right, so she kind of your mentor. She mentors you. Yeah, she be telling me the ways too. So yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's cool, man. Okay. Which coach would you shout out? Shout out, <laughs> Coach Miles, my defensive coordinator, <laughs> real one. <laughs> yeah. Why Coach Miles so cool, man? Uh, it's just I don't know. It's the that's the homie. You know, he be he be real with me. Real with all the all the players, so yeah. Yeah, and he was a uh, he went to UA. Mm -hmm. Went to yeah. UA. So. Okay, so he he know the ropes. Yes, sir. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Well, that's it, man. All right.